there was a, a family that had acquired a little new kitten. And they were playing with their new kitten in the garden, and the kitten went up a tree, and it got stuck between two sharp branches, and it couldn't get out. And it was in a lot of distress. And the family tried to get to the little kitten, but because of all the branches, it was very difficult to get to it. But the father was a pastor, and he was always coming up with great ideas. So he says, don't worry, daddy to the rescue. I'm going to get my car, I'm going to get a rope. I'm going to tie the rope around the tree. I'm going to tie it onto the car. I'm going to get in the car. I'm going to drive a bit. The tree will come down, and then we'll be able to maneuver around, and we'll be able to save the little kitten. Everyone said, Daddy, to the rescue. Daddy gets his car, gets the rope, ties the rope around the tree, ties it onto the car, gets in the car, begins to drive. Slowly, slowly, the tree's bending, bending. The car's moving. As the car moves, as the tree bends, the rope snaps. As the rope snaps, the tree flings back and the little pussycat goes flying in the opposite direction. And that's the end of the story. <laughs> Two weeks later, the pastor is visiting a member of his congregation. He knocks on the door, the door opens, the lady says, Pastor, come in. As he walks in, there in the hallway was his little kitten. He knew it was unmistakable. So he didn't want to say to her, that's my kitten. So he said, that's a lovely little kitten you've got. Have you had her long? <laughs> she says, Pastor, you're not going to believe this. But it was two weeks ago. It was a hot, sunny Saturday afternoon. And I was in my garden with our little son, Johnny. And Johnny said, Mummy, please, can we have a kitten? <laughs> and I said, No, we are not having a cat. We've discussed this many, many times. We're not going to have a kitten. But pastor, he pestered me and pestered me. The only thing I could think of doing was to say, I'll tell you what, Johnny, let's kneel down here in the garden <laughs> and we'll pray to the Lord Jesus. And if the Lord Jesus wants to give you a kitten, he'll give you a kitten. <laughs> pastor, you are not going to believe this. When we pray, <laughs> coincidences happen. And when we don't, they don't.